Welcome back to our educational channel. In today's video, we will explore the concepts of education as envisioned by prominent thinkers and educators throughout history. Let's begin. One influential figure in the realm of education is Mahatma Gandhi, who championed the concept of basic education or the Vedā educational system. Gandhi believed in providing education that is rooted in practical skills, vocational training, and community development. Rabindranath Tagore, on the other hand, emphasized the importance of learning that takes place in nature and from nature. He believed that nature itself is a powerful teacher, and education should foster a deep connection between individuals and their natural surroundings. Sri Aurobind introduced the concept of integral education, which aims to nurture the holistic development of individuals. Integral education encompasses physical, intellectual, emotional, and spiritual growth fostering a harmonious balance in one's being. S. Radhakrishnan, a philosopher and statesman, highlighted the spiritual aspects of Indian philosophy in education. He emphasized the need to integrate spiritual values and ethics into the educational process, enabling individuals to lead meaningful and purposeful lives. Jiddu Krishnamurti believed that education should go beyond the acquisition of knowledge and focus on the transformation of the human mind. He emphasized self-awareness, critical thinking, and the exploration of one's own consciousness as essential components of education. Maria Montessori, a renowned educator, advocated for self-education through the development of individuality. Her Montessori method emphasized hands-on learning, independent exploration, and the freedom to learn at one's own pace. John Dewey, an influential American philosopher, promoted experiential teaching and learning. Dewey believed that education should be centered around real-life experiences, problem-solving, and active engagement, enabling students to develop practical skills and critical thinking abilities. Friedrich Froebel introduced the concept of kindergarten or the playway method, emphasizing the importance of play and creative activities in early childhood education. Froebel believed that through play, children learn important social, emotional, and cognitive skills. Finally, Rousseau advocated for a more natural approach to education, where formal learning is eschewed, and nature becomes the primary teacher. Rousseau believed that education should be guided by the natural instincts and curiosity of the individual. Each of these thinkers and educators has contributed valuable insights and perspectives to the concept of education, shaping the way we approach teaching and learning today. We hope this journey through the concepts of education has provided you with a deeper understanding of the diverse philosophies that have shaped educational practices over time. Remember, education is a dynamic field that continues to evolve and adapt to the needs of learners and society. If you found this video informative, please consider liking and subscribing to our channel for more enlightening content. Thank you for joining us today, and we look forward to exploring more educational topics with you in the future.